Well, the National Guard civil support team is in Spokane. They're testing two letters possibly laced with ricin found at the uh, post office in downtown Spokane. Threatening letters were discovered this week and then addressed to a federal judge and the post office. It's a story you saw first on KXOI. Ian Cole is live in the studio now with an update on the investigation. Ian. And Nadine, the FBI and United States Postal Inspection Service are investigating these letters and trying to track down who sent them. Meanwhile, the civil support team from the National Guard in Tacoma is now in Spokane to determine if the substance found in those letters is in fact ricin. Ricin is a highly toxic substance derived from castor beans. An amount the size of the head of the pin can kill an adult. The threatening letters were first discovered Tuesday morning. Spokane police secured the area, tested for explosives, and cleared the scene. But late last night, the American Poster Workers posted on its website that preliminary lab tests indicated the presence of ricin on those letters. So today, the National Guard civil support team was sent to Spokane to investigate. It consists of 20 personnel highly trained in hazmat situations. Now, a month ago, a similar team checked letters for rice in, in Mississippi. The team travels with nine vehicles and includes a mobile hazmat center. They come in, are given the letters that are double bagged for safety, then they'll bring it into the lab they have and test it. And the team will usually come in to test this as soon as possible. Other times, they'll take it to a location. Usually a period of a week goes by before people will experience the symptoms. The Postal Workers Union added in that letter, there is no reason to believe that any employees are at risk at those letters passed through the mailroom. Ian Cole, KXOY4 News.